Hi, kids! Today, we will learn the various ways you can exchange your coins. So let's get started. I am a quarter. My value is 25 cents. You can exchange me with smaller coins in just so many ways. Let's learn. One way is 25 pennies, as one penny is one cent. So, 25 pennies make 25 cents. So you can exchange 25 pennies for a quarter. Other way can be 20 pennies and a nickel. As 20 pennies make 20 cents and 1 nickel is 5 cents. So in total we have 25 cents. 20 cents plus 5 cents equals 25 cents. Yeah! So we can exchange this set of coins too for a quarter. Other way can be 15 pennies and 2 nickels. Let's see how. 15 pennies will make 15 cents. And 2 nickels will make 10 cents. So, in total we will have 25 cents. 15 cents plus 10 cents equals 25 cents. So, we can exchange this set of coins too for a quarter. Another way can be 10 pennies and 3 nickels. As 10 pennies will make 10 cents and 3 nickels will make 15 cents. So, in total we will have 25 cents. 15 cents plus 10 cents equals 25 cents. So, we can exchange this set of coins too for a quarter. Let's learn one more way. 5 pennies and 4 nickels. As 5 pennies make 5 cents, 5 pennies equals 5 cents. And four nickels make 20 cents. So, in total, we will have 25 cents. So we can exchange this set of coins too for a quarter. Let's learn one more way. Five pennies and two dimes. As five pennies make five cents, two dimes make 20 cents. So in total, we will have 25 cents. We have 5 cents plus 20 cents equals 25 cents. So we can exchange this set of coins too for a quarter. There can be just so many ways. See, one more way. One nickel and two dimes. Two dimes make 20 cents. One nickel makes 5 cents. So, in total we will have 25 cents. So we can exchange this set of coins too for a quarter. So kids, you now know there are so many ways you can use your coins or exchange them for smaller coins. Now go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye-bye. Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects.